hello everyone welcome to my third video about pro python programming uh, you can pause the video and you can read the the statement so where on which i can i will um, put the code on the console so basically today we're gonna use again the iteration and strings to uh, to compute the street street name and the number in a given string so without any delay let's do it so yes i'm going to use the same online python compiler don't worry i will give you the description down uh sorry i will give you the link below down in the description so here we go so first of all i'll make a, a function name format address you can you can name anyone and in that uh, format address function i'll provide as an address string a variable from which i will create a, a product so within this function i'll i created two empty strings one is the house number and the other one is street name why because as you see for example like i have to make two strings one is numbered and one is the the word form so let's this is how i created house number and street name and i created another string but this time i call it a separate why separate so whatever string i'll get as a as a sentence so it will uh, so it so i need it to split it so that's why I'm going to use a split function to split between house number and the street name. So split function is very useful to break down the, the strings of any given uh, message. It will split into half or you can say split into two uh, different variables. Now I'm going to use iteration like for loop. So I'm going to introduce another uh, variable named element for every element means for every single um, word uh, in the address string i'm gonna make an iteration iteration in that function and i'm gonna say that if the element in the message if it's digit then it should be uh, stored in uh, variable name house number make sure the is by the way is digit is another function you can use it to uh, get the numbered uh, variables within the string and similarly within that loop as an if if it's num if the messages uh, contains number it will go to house number uh, variables uh, the the empty string or if it's not then whatever the remaining um, remaining sequence of the words it will add up to the another string named street name and street name it will add up to my uh, add up to our new uh, string and you will see it like I'll, you'll see it when i'll run the compiler so this is how it and also um, when it's done when the iteration is done I'm gonna return that variable back to the main function so I want to know what should I do like what variable I'll bring it any guesses yes so I'm gonna put I'm gonna put like house name and on the street named I'm gonna put another uh, string so why did I put these brackets this is these brackets are actually uh, they are assigning with the, with another function I use it's called format function you can use format function to put anything in the given message so this is how I use format function 
to address those variables to assign to those variables and this is you see it, it will show the message just like that for example one two three main street so one two three is a number and main street is a is a character so like I said like I put house number as a numbered uh, I defined it as an open uh, string but later I put it all the digits by using is digit function and characters as a and the other one street name as a character uh, string so let's do this so here we are and we'll be doing that format address so yeah let's do the print function so we're doing the print function and uh, and I'm going to put the same format the one that is given like for example so I'll say 123 main street because here main street I have given the the address string up above top so that goes this message goes as a string up there and it will break down into one two three and the main screen let's run the compiler voila there it is house number one two three on the street named main so this is how you do it by using um, by using the uh, format function let's do another example format address and what's that 55 north center drive okay i'm gonna copy that i'm gonna paste here make sure it's good oh i just want to put in inverted uh, in double commas to make sure it will go as a string all together and one more bracket if i run there we go house name on the 55th named north so this is how you do it uh, you can break any sort of strings into two uh, formats you can separate those numbers and those uh, the, the characters and and you can use iteration to automate the code until the whole string is done and this is how you do it so this is all from now so you can you can put any sort of examples you can try by yourself or you can do the old style method by by going to string each by each word by word but it's gonna make it gruesome and it's gonna be I have to say ugly so don't do that uh, just keep practicing Python is very fun and it's very useful for your uh, future uh, everything for now and I will come back with another interesting problem with the solution have a good one